I just have one question. When Cap needed help, if I'd asked you, would you have come? I guess we'll never know. But if you had, you'd have never been caught. Damn. Music stuff. Things. And the people I love the most, they pay the price. Thanks to you, we had to run. <laughs> We're still so running. Why not? Let's go. <laughs> Ghost looks sick, right? Maybe you just need someone watching your back. Like a partner. Oh, that's awesome. I like that. Hold on. You gave her wings and blasters. So I take it you didn't have that tech available for me? No, I did. <laughs> That looked awesome. That looked better than I was expecting. Uh, okay, let me get the let me get the green screen out of the way. <laughs> ah, it's falling on me. Get up on out of here, man. That looked much better than I was expecting. Damn, we're quite spoiled for Marvel stuff this year. We got Black Panther in two two weeks. Oh dear, I better hurry up my Black Panther videos then, don't I? <laughs> and then obviously Infinity War. Come on, God damn, I can't wait for that. That's that's uh. I think I might actually die whilst watching it. The excitement I see when I see like 97, I think it's like what, 93 days left today? Cause like uh, uh, on Instagram, uh, they keep showing, it's like counting down the days and it's just, I can't, I can't, I can't even explain boys and girls how exciting I am. And that's the culmination of my life at the minute is how excited I am. I was a huge fan of the first Ant-Man. Really liked it, really liked it. I, I, I enjoyed the comedy aspect of it as well because it wasn't quite Guardians comedy. Um, it's a little more tongue in cheek. I prefer grounded things to space films. Uh, I like space, who doesn't like space? Weirdos don't like space. Or Martians, angry Martians don't like space. I'm, ca I'm, call I'm calling it now. Angry Martians do not like space. And if there's an angry Martian, who sees this and says, yeah, no, actually, I do like space, mate. Um, that was a stereotype you've just imbued upon us all. And that's not okay. Well, then, I, for that, I apologize, Angry Martian. From the TV, but what, 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 why do I have a brain? What is my brain on? Sometimes I wonder why I have a brain. You know, you just like, you just ramble on about nonsense. But I guess that's why you're watching. Oh, well, no, really, you're watching for Ant-Man and Wasp, let's be honest. That's why I'm watching this. <laughs> That's why I'm making the damn thing. Right, key points. I like the carrying off Civil War. I wasn't sure what they were going to do, whether they were going to cut it straight from, like, Guardian style, and uh, have it only a few months after the first film, uh, which which could, you know, it could have worked. But I like that they've carried on after Civil War. That's cool. Because it we might get to see how Scott gets out of the raft, as we see at the end of Civil War. In the Infinity War prelude comic, uh, I believe they're carrying on immediately from the airport battle. We'll probably, I, I haven't read it yet, I wanna read it. I actually saw it earlier today in uh, Forbidden Planet, but I got the Doomsday Clock instead. Very good series. I believe in that they show from people, from Team Cap going in, get, you know, getting arrested. Oh, Captain America breaking everyone out, sorry. And them going on the run, I, I don't know, I don't know. But uh, yeah, I like that they've carried on from that. Wasp looks sick. The, the team dynamic uh, works really well. That music was also, that song, I don't know what that song was, but I want it. <laughs> I want to frame it. I don't care if you can't frame music. I want somebody to get that song, take the vibrations of that song, manifest them in a physical way, almost in a, some sort of disc-shaped format. You know, take the, take that song, put it in 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 a kind of a disc-type thing, and then perhaps put it in a small box, small square, maybe, and just put it put it inside that. I call it a CD. But no, that song is awesome. I want to frame it. 
I want to put it on my wall, that song specifically, I'm going to have it playing. Oh, actually, you know what? It's not inconceivable. I could actually do it, couldn't I? I could have, by a frame, attached two little speakers to the bottom of the frame, and then have it constantly playing. There you go, that's how you frame a song. Sorted, mate. Or you just tell, tell the police it did a murder. Get it? Frame a song. Wasp, yeah, the team dynamic between Ant-Man and Wasp looks fantastic. Um, Wasp's costume, I'm not mad on it. I like, well, the colours. I don't like the colours. Let me be specific. I don't like the colours of it. In the comics, she has black and yellow. Uh, you know, like a wasp does. <laughs> and it looks really cool. And I feel like Ant-Man's costume now is quite bold in the red and black they have. And uh, it just looks nicer. I feel like having wasp as the yellow and black as opposed to the weird blue and sort of musty colour it would just look nicer, I think. And I'm sure perhaps in Infinity War they might change it. I don't know. Oh, no, they can't. No, they wouldn't because Infinity War's finished filming now. And this comes out after Infinity War. What am I talking about? Yeah, that's a. Yeah, see, okay. So this is set after Civil War, but before Infinity War. <laughs> in between the wars. Okay. Now I'm getting an idea of the timeline and where everything is. It's all, all up in the air. See, I don't know when Black Panther. I'm assuming Black Panther is also set after Civil War. Uh. Yeah, no, it is, it is, because T'Challa's king at that point, and, uh, yeah, okay. I'm going to do a review on Black Panther when it comes out. I'm, uh, very, very excited for that film. Ghost looks really cool. It, kind of freaky, actually. Uh, for those of you who don't know who Ghost is, uh, Ghost is, I think, primarily an Iron Man villain. And he, he was a hacker. He could, he can go into things and hack them. I don't, I don't really know. I don't remember much. I read, I did read Invincible Iron Man. I read the the, uh, the run. Mark Wade, I think it was, wrote it. I read uh, his run on Invincible Iron Man, and Ghost did make an appearance in that. Uh, what what her? It's a she. It's a female in the film. What her role in the film is uh, compared to the comics, I don't know. We'll find out soon enough. But I'll probably do a uh, character profile video on um, Ghost when we get closer to Iron Man. July, man, that's that's soon. It looks like a lot of the humor from the first one is back as well, which is which is pretty pretty. Pretty cool. Uh, actually, that scene with the knife was dope. I like that. I've not, I can't really, not really much else to say on this, to be quite honest with you, because I'm not terribly invested <laughs> as I am compared to the rest of them. Like, I enjoy Ant-Man, but as, a, as far as what I'm expecting to see, or what I'm hoping to see, not really much. Like, I've never been a huge Ant-Man fan in the comics. Like, it's, I think it's easier for me talking about something like... Oh, I think it's easy for me talking about something like, say, Civil War or Infinity War, Iron Man, you know, because I I know the comics. Um, I, I, kind of think, I don't think I've actually read an Ant-Man comic. I've read comics with him in it. But I'm not, I've not read any of his solo series, so I can't, I, I can't say what I'm expecting to see. Uh, in comparison to the comics, perhaps I'll, you know what I will. I've got I've got uh, Marvel Unlimited. It's a, it's kind of like Netflix for comics for Marvel comics. Absolutely fantastic uh, app. It's what ten pounds ten pounds a month. And I tell you what, the amount of comics you get on there. Oh, stop itchy hand. The amount of comics you get on there compared and it's all quite current as well. Uh, it's six months behind normal release. So for example. Edge of, uh, Edge of Venomverse, that's a stupid name, but very good series. Um, issue 3 of that has just come out on the app yesterday, because it updates each Monday. Uh, I don't know what issue they're on now, but we still not got to the legacy stuff yet. I think it might be coming next week. Secret Empires issue 7. So it's, it's quite up to date. And you think, for what you would spend on the comics per issue, because I bought, uh, like I say, I bought Doomsday Clock um, earlier. It's like a fiver for the comic alone, you know what I mean? <laughs> for one for one issue, mind. Five pounds for one issue. Marvel Unlimited, ten pounds. Many issues you can read through. And you can binge a lot of series. I'm I'm binging Ultimate Spider-Man at the moment. I'm nearly at the end of that. Uh of the Peter Parker run. And then I'm gonna carry on with the Miles Morales one. And then we'll go from there. As I say, there's not there's not a, a terrible amount I can say about the film in terms of what I'm expecting. Cause I don't I don't care. <laughs> I, I, I'm not I'm not invested in this character as such. It does like I say, it looks fantastic. I'm very impressed. That song choice was awesome. The tone seems very akin to the first one. And I tell you what, it's nice as well that they're not they've not done because Marvel has a villain problem. 
let's we all know it. I'll I'll do a I'll do a video on that at some point. But it's nice to s not see another Ant Man again. Like Yellow Jacket was just Ant Man. And it's it's like ah come on. So it'll be interesting to see how they fight Ghost. Uh, and it seems the shrinking tech is all cool. I don't know, guys. It looks it looks good. <laughs> I'm gonna see it. Of course, I'm gonna see it. Marvel could release a film about a toilet. Just 20 minutes of a, two hours of a toilet. Not doing anything. Just a toilet. I would still see it and rate it five stars. Toilet Man. I might pitch that to Marvel. Hey Marvel, if you're listening, Toilet Man, hit me up. I'll, uh, I mean, Captain Underpants is a thing, isn't it? It's not quite a toilet, nor is it Marvel. <sighs> anyway, thank you all so much for watching. What, let me know in the comments what you guys thought of the trailer. And if, and what, what you're expecting from the film. Because, as I say, if you are an Ant-Man fan, let me know. Other than that, thank you all so much for watching. Links to the socials in e You all know the drill. Like, subscribe, blah, 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 blah. <laughs> Not quite a toilet, nor is it Marvel. <sighs> anyway, thank you all so much for watching. What, let me know in the comments what you guys thought of the trailer. And if and what, what you're expecting from the film. Because, as I say, if you are an Ant-Man fan, let me know. Other than that, thank you all so much for watching. Links to the socials in you all know the drill. Like, subscribe, blah, 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 blah. blah. <laughs>